Welcome to the city of Hue, home of the famous Imperial City of Hue and one of Vietnam's seven UNESCO World Heritage Sites. In this video, we will be giving you a deep dive into the Imperial City and the surrounding area, as well experience an Imperial dinner where we sample food that was inspired by the dinners of the past. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome to the Rocket Experience Vietnam from South to North series. We are a family from the States traveling Vietnam in search for our new home. Join us as we venture through this truly magical country. We hope you enjoy your stay with us and consider subscribing to our channel. The Imperial City of Wei is a walled fortress and palace and once home to the Wing Dynasty for 140 years, dating back from 1805 until 1945. The Imperial City of Wei is divided into two main parts, the Citadel and the Forbidden City. They're gonna let you try the wine that was designed by the king. Okay. And the tea that was only for royalty. Um, designed by the King Wing, uh, Minh Mang, right? So it's to help the circulation, blood circulation, uh, menstrual problems, arthritis. Try it. Um, it used to be only for royalty. So we're royalty today. Okay, try it. Cheers! Mm. 
Let's try royal. Is this this is tea, right? Tea. This is tea wine. wine. Oh, wine. this is royal wine. <laughs> oh, it's strong, buddy. Wow. Good for you. Yeah. Cheers. It's, it's, it's super strong. I think I might be drunk. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's, it's definitely strong. Wow. You guys want some tea? You'll get you messed up quick. Mm, the tea is good. Right. Trying to try some tea? Oh, the tea is very good, especially when it's 105 outside. And it's chilled. Very nice. Imperial tea. Oh, let me see. Here. You wanna buy one? So this is this is the imperial tea that we're drinking. It's very nice. Two hundred thousand for a satchel. This is the ingredients. So this is so this is the wine. No, this is the ingredients. And then that's the ingredients for the wine. Yeah. Wow, look. Look. Wow, you got dried seahorses. Mm -hmm. Dried seahorses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all of this was in this wine. Mm -hmm. Dried seahorses. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Starfish, uh, mushrooms, all sorts of snake. Snake? I drank some snake. Good lord. Oh, ginseng is in there. Look at this tea.
we're gonna be having an imperial dinner. That's right, so um, here in Wei, because we are in the imperial city, um, there are these restaurants that will serve you um, the exact same way that the Imperials would eat. So that's what we decided to do today and I'm kind of excited to show you guys. So come on in, let's go check it out. Let's try. Mm. This is a really, really good crab soup. Really, really good. You can definitely taste the crab. It is really, really thick. And then the egg just gives it like that creamy flavor. Oh man, so good. I can actually taste a lot of the crab. Yeah, it's really, really Not good. Not imitation. Yeah, really, really good. I like it. Very nice. This, this is the Phoenix Appetizer. How the jazz different than like the so normal we're, jazz? We're gonna try the jazz. So this is jazz. It's basically like the Phoenix wing. Very, very nicely prepared. Let's try this. Dip it in the uh, fish sauce. Let's try. I There's lost. a plate. Let's try. The jazz is very nice. So it has an eggy flavor to it. And um, you can taste the vegetables. I mean, they, they really spent time to wrap this up. I mean, this is really nice. And then this one looks like another piece Name. of ham. It's a piece oh, look, of ham. this is a salad. So this is ham. Kind of like a, like a ham noodle, like but this is too. a piece of ham. Oh. This is really good. Mm. I'm I like that. Some kind of beef. So Can this looks like it's pork wrapped uh, wrapped in like a like a leaf. Um, very 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 popular in Vietnam. You would see these just walking around in the uh, night market. Oh, oh, that's really good too. Mm. So we got the fried shrimp. Uh, it's a special wrapping, almost like a bean curd. I would say. Oh, that shrimp is my favorite so far. Mm. Um, open good. your plate. Super open good. your plate. And then next we just got the fried egg roll. Yeah. Try the fried egg roll. Ethan, you want the soup? Uh, I changed my mind. The fried egg roll was really was my favorite. All the stuff here is really, really good. I like it a lot. Really, really good. Next dish is look at this. This is so cool. Is we got the, uh, the fried prawns. This is the fried prawns. Uh, actually, no, sauteed prawns. No, no. Got it. Yeah, sautéed and garlic prawns. Look at that. Look really nice. Yeah. Then we got this cool little boat. That's uh, made from um, pineapple. Like no, papaya. Yeah, papaya. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. Oh man. Look how they did it. So it's a it's on, and then they they sliced it like a lobster. Look at that. It's really cool. It's really cool. Really juicy. You can see that juice coming out. Mm. It has almost like a Chinese taste. Try this like lobster shrimp kind of. Oh, that's really good too. So it's not too sweet. Um, not too salty. A little bit. A little bit sweet. But it's also got an umami flavor to it. Very, very nice. Very subtle. It's, it's, um, it has almost like a Chinese. Yeah, it's a very subtle flavor. It's good. I can see how only kings will eat this before. Next we got the, um, the beef uh, sautéed with, um, looks like mushrooms. It looks really, really nice. They put a lot of time into this. Yeah. And we're going to grab some of this beef right here. With the mushroom. Look at that. Oh, it looks so good. All right, so let's try it. This is really good. So this one here has an umami flavor to it, just a little bit. Why does it have umami? But very good. This is very good. I like this a lot. I like the mushroom flavor. Mm. And the meat, very tender, very good. Oh yeah. Oh, I enjoy this a lot. 
This is the shrimp with stir, shrimp crab and um, stir-fried noodles with Napa cabbage. Oh man, look at this. Let's give this a go, guys. All right, so we're gonna grab some of this, some of this really hot noodle. So this actually has like a Cantonese type of flavor. This is very nice, very nice, very nice. I like this one. And you got the Napa cabbage. Mmm. Mm. Crab. A bit of crab. Oh. This is really, really nice. Mm. I like this a lot. I like this one. Mm. 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 Like I said, this here has more like of a Cantonese flavor to it. I like it a lot. Very, very good. Look at this thing. Oh my goodness. Look at that. So nice. And then we got the stuffed crab. So we're going to have the stuffed crab. Very nice. So we've got the stuffed crab right here. Oh my goodness, let's try this, buddy. We got the crab meat right here. Let's try. This one's okay. It doesn't really have a lot of flavor to it. And they didn't really give us a sauce. Almost, I would almost pass on this one. This one is not good. Just finished our, we just finished our imperial dinner. What do you think about it? I feel like a royalty. I mean, I, they spend so much time on the presentation, and I think it's more on the presentation than the food. Uh, the food is good, actually. The food is good, but I don't think the food is like anything spectacular. It's just like normal. It's almost like Vietnamese slash Chinese food. You know what I'm saying? But the presentation, and I think maybe that's how royals used to eat. Yep. It's like remember the royals wouldn't eat it unless it looked. And good unless too. it looks good, so you yeah. can't just have like. You can't just have like a spring roll on a plate and put like lettuce on the bottom, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like they need to have this phoenix, this dragon yeah, or whatever, the royals. Yeah, so, so that's how they eat. But that's how they eat. Besides that, the flavor was really good. The flavor is really good. And everything was actually uh, decently priced. Like we were looking at everything, everything is about $150,000. Yeah. Which is very reasonable. For very like reasonable. crab and everything, so very reasonable. Very reasonable. Uh, I definitely recommend this place. I really like yeah. Wei. You guys should come back, come Wei? down here. Check it out if you're in Way. Um, it's not very far from downtown, so really good. Ethan likes it too. And it reminds us of the entire I, city I that we went to this I morning, right? I wish if right? I could just play with the dragon. Yeah. I wish if I had that he wanted, dragon. He wanted to play with his food. No, yeah, it looks it looks pretty. Yeah, but, um, <laughs> all right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed that. We did. See you later.